Duraga's family crypt. How'd they fit four, six, eight people in there? Okay. Where the fuck is it? It's still doing there, man. Wait, what do I So it's upstairs then. It is, it's is not in here. I wish I keep would stop running into the fucking doors. There must be a crypt above the ground then. What's this one? There. Oh, that's the one I've been in, right? Something's not right. Need to hide, see how things play out. Right. Catch them at it, ghost fucking. <laughs> You'd rather lie about all day, flipping those cards like some some dwarf, disgusting. Ah, there we go. Indeed, far better to stand at the door of Lepiota's temple, mumbling prayers from dawn till dusk. In great. I prayed for you, that you would cast off the yoke of gambling. Fine job you did of it. Seems the <laughs> gods had also heard enough of your cackling. And you? Why are you here? This is a private conversation. <laughs> Mind keeping it down? Neighbors are complaining. Neighbors? Everyone here is dead! I know not your name, but you must help me. I refuse to spend eternity at the side of this heathen. Remove him from my crypt at once! <laughs> Slow down. What's the problem? This is my crypt, and this saintly shrew harangues me even in death. An eternity of nagging for misery! <laughs> I was blind and a fool to marry him! He's a slave to the cards, prepared to wager his own child on a round of Gwent. Hmm? Once, damn it, and as a jest. How many times must I explain? And who sank our fortune into some silly statue of Lebioda? Piety. That was my cause. The prophet immortalized would have transformed this land of blasphemy and betting. How was I to know it was all a fraud? <laughs> because I warned you some five hundred times! Quiet. Shut up, both of you. <laughs> Who does the crypt belong to, rightfully? Must you ask? It's mine. My family's. The decorant towns. Are you illiterate? True. But my dowry served to repurchase it from those you owed. Look, if there's to be peace and quiet here, one of you's gotta go. Need to move one of you out. Yes, take him. Please, do so. And I shall... I shall tell you where I hit his lucky Gwent okay, cards. Gwent cards. Oh, well, that's enough for me. What? I knew it was you! And now... You would evict me from my crypt, then pay for the deed with my cards! Yes, uh, you deserve it. He deserves it, he deserves it, it's fine. Blast it all! Had I those very cards at the tournament in Balhaven, I'd still be alive! It's your fault, you pox incarnate, that they stabbed me to death! 
They murdered you for your debts. I had nothing to do with it. Come, I heed this good book thumping wench. Mind, I know well where she hid those cards. I'll tell you myself as soon as you've removed her. Well, she hid them. <sighs> Need to think about it. All right, gotta move one of them out. <clears throat> Thus spake the prophet yeah. Lepiota. Thou Where's shalt the not play for coin. After which he promptly added, For you shall have none left for me! Heretic, shut your mouth! Right, get the arm. I see you fell for that pious tart's drivel. Drax! Oh, well, then listen. I've a request. Be a good fellow and set me in the chamber of the Gwent Friendship Society of mm -hmm. Beauclair. It's just round the corner. No, you remember. That's just it. I was not. But I would have dearly liked to have been. And joining them in death shouldn't bother anyone. I don't know. Certainly doesn't bother me. I'll do it. Where's this chamber? Ah, once you enter the catacombs, go straight. The chamber will be on your right, near the corridor's mouth, and I thank you. Okay. That sounds like a, a reasonable request. And then she can get, give me the cards, eh? <laughs> Right, so let's take his arm and put him in the... Deeper in the catacombs. Yeah, go to the right. Right, let's go. Let's get the catacombs, go straight, and it should be on the right, it says. Okay. Yeah. Chamber Louis mentioned, gotta be. Okay, so where to place the arm? I suppose at the bottom. Mm. You'll not find work here. Not paying work, that is. Where are these? Yeah, fucking grave diggers. What the fuck? You gents also looking for that Gwent club? <laughs> What the poking devils? Who are you? Who sent you? So many questions, so few answers. Blimey, we're a plumbing philosopher. Get the swarmy cat diddler, lads. <sighs> if I only had a crown for every time a bunch like this. <laughs> can join the Gwent Club. There's uh, four, four new ones for the Gwent Club, mate. Uh, so, uh, what to Gwent? Proposal number seven for the anthem of the Gwent Friendship Society by Queer Author Stephen D. D. Duve, Master Cooper, Gwent's right already wearing Gwent and night. And it will be fine when before you two armies clash, your cares melt off in a dash, then you wish by to play, 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 but her indoors wines hit the hey, hey, hey. Such minds are dull as muddy yards to think this but a game of cards. Close, where is one or two, blah, blah, blah. Right, enough of that. Right. High time Margot paid up. Right. Let's go see Margot, get the cards. Oh, they're good ones. Do, 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 do. Oh, pardon me. <laughs> oh! Okay. Da 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 Give me my great fucking cows, motherfucker. Done. Now where you got those cards? 
Leave the city through the Cooper's Gate. Then we are right. Our house is easily recognized. A tree atones the sign above the door. I buried the chest in the garden beneath the rose bush. Oh, tree on the sign, rose bush. Think I got it. I hope I don't have to fucking find a shovel to dig it up. That always pissed me off in Fallout, man. You get somewhere, it pick, picks on you. Might I ask you dig what you did with Louis? True, he knew shovel. nothing in life but Gwent, but I would still prefer he not spend eternity in a ditch or a privy. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it. Found him a nice place. Ought to feel right at home. Farewell. But what about you? You got to spend eternity by yourself. That must be fucking boring, you know what I mean? But then maybe you'll just sit and pray forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever. I wonder if there's anything else in the cemetery to find. Put out here, put out these things, put these entrances. Can I get in? Locked. Okay, so there might be other stuff to come back here for. But, um, the doors are locked, so I might have to get other quests or something. This is a huge fucking place, man. Yeah, the door's locked. Okay. That's a deal though, you know, I'll go and get the cards, wait there. I need to see that guy though as well, if I can get my reward for quite a quarter sand is like a rat catcher. Good. Wait, 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 wait. No. Don't I get fucking till death has to part. So collect the reward. I'll search the fish later. The famed Zero to Free Booming means cognac selling like fresh buns on the morn. Pleased yeah. customers stream. Fresh buns, that's, that's a good one. Do you see the wisdom of it? Long live our lady. The Duchess. Hey there, I'm done. Cemetery ought to be real nice and quiet now. Ah, to sleep in my own bed once more. The clocks has grown intolerably loud. The punters bellow like men possessed. One madman especially, always shouting, ordering, ordering. But tell me, at the cemetery, what was it? Beasts, as you claimed? Nope, just a marital spat. That's it? But they hollered like skewered pole cats. Mm -hmm. Sorry to bother you with such a trifle. Here for your trouble. Mm -hmm. You didn't pay me much anyway. 60, yeah, 60 drinks. That's, that was reasonable. Death to us part. Sets the house of sheep. Press the mark there. Right. I need to go and have another quick piss. I will be back in a minute. Long live our lady, oh, the Duchess. Oh. 